Hello everybody, how nice to see you again and again. Uh, tonight is a very interesting task. If you stay with us, we're going to tell you all about this. And now again, we have a guest, keep calm and drive Jaguar. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Paul, keep well, calm. Hello, welcome back, Archie and Chrissy Shall Mr. we take a Paul. seat? Yes, we shall. Have you seen my shoes? I'm trying to keep calm, but when you own a Jaguar, unfortunately, you get very, very stressed. Have you? Oh, have we seen her shoes? There we are. Let's go see the booth shoes. Have, have a seat at the booth. I have to. I have to stand with these beautiful shoes, but I will. Um, Let's have a, have a little chat about the boat trips today. Yeah. You fancy that? Yes. Uh, it's it's a very different uh, thing of what you can see. Uh, in uh, well, wherever is a blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea, therefore it should be some boats on it. Is it not right? This is true. Jaguar themed all the way through. Big, big shout out to, of course, Baron of the Big Guns, Baron Nigel, Nigel. and of course, Baroness. Oh, 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 so, oh, so, oh, so. oh, oh, so, so sweet, Caroline. And yes. also, it's two people's wedding anniversary, by the way. 26 years for our Lord M and the greatest, 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 greatest Spanish teacher in the world, Lady Andrea. Andrea. Happy wedding anniversary. Happy wedding anniversary. And our Lady Sue and her Sir Dave, Dave. 60 years of marriage. My goodness, wow. I am collapsing. Well done, well done you. Um, this must be uh, the people could know how to do it, how to go through the life with uh, respect, uh, love, and uh, enjoying. Yeah, so a very, very happy anniversary, happy anniversary to, you to you guys. Now, tonight's video, as Christy Lepouf has told you, in that blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea, there are one or two boats, and we've been around and collected one or two of the brochures. We've shown you on camera many times, but we're actually going to talk you through the brochures. And of course, there's prices and information. So I'm going to let Grisila Booth choose one of them. Which one are you going to choose? Just choose one of the pamphlets, and that'll be the first one we'll go through. Let it be the biggest. You're going one. to go through the big one. Okay, there we are. This is the Wave Dancer. There's their brochure, by the way. And of course, you can find them on the Tinternet as well at wavedancercypress.com. But you can't find all the information that we're going to give you. Wave Dancer, crews and events. Obviously, there's one or two guys in the harbour promoting it. We've got Nick, all the way from downtown in Wales. And, of course, Denise, our blonde beauty, in the harbour. And she'll talk you through it, by the way. Under no pressure, but let's go through and see what they've got to offer. What Big boat, Denise? Isn't it? Ruth. Ruth. I apologise. It is Ruth. I, I am looking... Call Denise, you know. I don't, I don't know. know Probably in your... Uh, this, this name... Uh, in in his imagination, this name suits to this woman, and this happens many times. Uh, I got happens. a feeling her middle name could be Denise, Ruth Denise. I <laughs> anyway, apologise. It doesn't matter. I'm looking at you. It doesn't matter. You. She won't mind as long as we don't call her any names, which we never would. Do you want to have a quick look at it? That is the big boat, by the way, and it is a big boat in the Papal Harbour, is. isn't it? When we went in after the renovation, we were quite uh, nicely surprised how huge difference we've seen there. It's been renovated and it's been done in a very, very nice, beautiful way. All was painted, all was differently mm. arranged. I, uh, I even, did I lie down in the little coffin there? I got a feeling you did, yes. Something like, uh, they, they did have a little boat, something like a little boat. I could... Uh, have to, um, I, I would have to fall uh, twice or maybe three times to go into that little boat. Uh, but I did <laughs> eventually and uh, I did like it, yeah, a little boat. <laughs> if you want to see that video, hunt in the YouTube search bar, Marika and me, Wave yeah. Dancer, and I'm pretty sure it will come up. Yeah. Now, they've got six different cruises on offer. One is the full day sunshine cruise, and that goes out every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday from 10 to 4 o'clock. Then they've got the half day barbecue cruise, which goes out every Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, and Sunday, and that is 11 until 3 o'clock. 
Mm -hmm. Then they've got the Sunset Barbecue Cruise, which goes out every Saturday and every Sunday from 5.30 until 8.30. Then it gets a bit more extravagant. Then they've got the night cruises. This one's adults only with fireworks. And that goes every Monday evening, 6.30 till 10.30. Then they've got the fireworks dinner show, night cruise. And that goes out every Tuesday, Thursday and Friday, 6.30 till 10.30. And then there's the variety show with all the acts and the singing and the dancing. And that is an evening cruise again, obviously. And that goes out every Wednesday, 6.30 until 10.30. Yeah. And there's a lot of details in here which we're going to go through in a minute. A lot of but details. But it's a nice boat, isn't it? It's a spotlessly clean. It's very important when you, you're now on the boat. If you don't uh, like any restaurant, any cafe, wherever you go into toilet, you can always run away. But where would you run away from the boat? So it's very important to know it's very, very clean and very well organized and the service quite well. Best. I think there's no doubt about it. All yeah. the cruise ships and the smaller operators, the little boats, take safety very, yeah. very seriously and cleanliness very, very seriously. What? Cleanliness, making sure they're clean. You're speaking Welsh now. It could be Welsh, I'm not sure. It's very <laughs> similar of what uh, uh, I used to hear from Paul. At the same time, whatever you choose and or whatever by the time, by the hours, or by, again, the price, what is, whatever is more suitable to you, this is what you have to choose. It doesn't matter what you choose. You always can have the same Mediterranean Sea, the same stuff. Uh, the staff is very attentive and very um, genuine guys working there, we know. Yeah, we've met so, many of them. And, yeah. of course, lots of people watching have been on many of these ships and they know how good they are they and these people go on them again and again and again so that's testament yeah. to the fact the cruises are good at the same time when you go in there you always uh, if you have any details to make to confirm with ruth not denise ruth what uh, or nick or nick yeah he uh, mr paul started to call her miss accidentally mistakenly should i say in my english in the very very beginning uh, denise this is how this name stuck and it's uh, stuck yeah it's it stuck. has stuck, it's with stuck. that's it but, uh, she's a lovely lady by the way lots she, of people know her very well yeah she lives in cyprus and of course so is nick nick's all the way from downtown in south wales you see and he's the big guy with the tattoos they but, always uh, can give you more information yeah i mean whatever. that's their job their job is to their explain job. it to you not to pressurize you it's our job to pressurise you to get on those cruise ships. Let's talk a little bit about the Sunset Cruise, or the Sunshine Cruise, as they call it. And I'm going to read you a little bit from their brochure. Do you it's not need all a, a nice? I've, I've got, got good eyes. You've got good eyes. Mm. You see, he's much older than me. He's 85 and he's still 86. got... 86. you are? Okay. <laughs> And he still got a better eyes than me. This is something. Well, something. there we are. It's a fact yeah. of life, unfortunately. I'm not my jealous. I'm, not, I'm, I'm just very happy about this. Marika always says she wants my eyes because they're blue. And I've always said, when I die, you can have them. No problem. How? How can it be possible? Well, when I die, you can just pull them out and <laughs> pop them on the mantelpiece. When you die, I would like to keep many things of you. <laughs> <laughs> right. Anyway, full day sunshine cruise on the Wave Dancer. It's an all-inclusive cruise, by the way. Mm -hmm. Many of their cruises are not, but this one is. And it is 75 euros per adult. And if you are a Littley, between the ages of four and 12, it's 38 euros. So one assumes if you're less than four, you haven't got to pay a single penny. Yeah. That's what I would assume. Yeah. So you could go on for free. Really? I think Why? so. Well, you're very, very young, aren't you? Yeah, okay, thank mm. you very much. Right, <laughs> and like What's I say, compliment? <laughs> It departs from Paphos Harbour and it takes the scenic route to Coral Bay. So it goes past sea caves and it goes in and around the St. George Island in the Acamas Bay and then it moses on down into Coral Bay and one assumes you can get off the boat, go into the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea, mm -hmm. perhaps swim up to the beach and get a bit of a suntan on the yeah. golden sands of Coral Bay as well. Some of the trips give you the possibility to jump into the sea. Some of the trips. Yeah, they do. Often they've got big slides and those kind yes, of things. Yes, big slides help in. And they've got many other things for well, There's them. all sorts on these all boats. Let's, let's read through it a little bit. Because it says, like I say, departing from Paphos Harbour, it eventually gets to Coral Bay. You've got a free transfer, by the way. So if, let's say you're in one of the hotels 
right at the far end of Cadiz Pathos. Let's say you were in the Olympic Lagoon, or let's say you were all Aquamari. the way in Aquamari Hotel. So one of the hotels you've chosen, if you've booked it, their bus will come and pick you up and take you to the Paphos Harbour. And of course, when the cruise is finished, that bus will pick you up and take you back to your hotel. So in and around Cadiz Paphos, in and around Universal, even as far as Clorica, mm -hmm. as I understand, yeah. totally free of charge. So that's something to remember. What else have they got? So it's all inclusive, like I said. So you've got a beautiful barbecue lunch served on the top deck. Now that sounds nice, doesn't it? Sun beaming wow. down, everything blue around you. It must be very nice. And a barbecue dinner. Mm, that we just sounds nice. go and visit it one day. Anyway, I would suggest to take another leaflet. Yeah, we can go on these over and over. I think we'll come back on other videos and pick cruises. But yeah, uh, yeah. Cruises. that could be the star cruise in the daytime called the Sunshine Cruise on the Wave Dancer. All inclusive, 75 euros. If you're four to 12, 38. If you're less than that, doesn't cost you a single penny. And you can eat all you can eat and you can drink all you can drink. What yeah. more can you want? Yeah. Wave Dancer, cruises and events. Christine Le Bouffe, there's a few more leaflets, so you choose one of them. It's like a lucky dip, isn't it? You're gonna have that one. So that's pathforseacruises.com. Right. And they got a few big boats as well. Ocean Vision. We'll talk about the Ocean Vision in this video, shall we? Yeah? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So let's have a quick look at it. Let's open it up. That's the Ocean Vision, by the way, which is the big boy in the Paphos Harbour. It's actually even bigger than the Wave Dancer. And it's got lots of blue lights. That's why we like it a lot. Yeah. Um, the brochure of Wave Dancer is much, much representative. I, I agree bigger. with you on that. Yeah, I it's agree. Big, it's bigger. But, uh, it's more representative. They, you can see, you can tell they spent much more money for yes, it. Yes, but they're only advertising one boat, whereas Paphos Sea Cruises oh, yeah. are this, advertising this explains the Ocean Vision. Different cruises on the Ocean Vision, the Sea Star, the Ocean Flyer. When we turn over the Jolly Roger, the Ocean Blue, they've got a lot of boats, if you understand. They but have so many boats, have, I yeah. think they don't, even they don't remember what they have. Well, they're very, very busy. Yes. And again, people repeat over and over and over. But we'll talk about the Ocean Vision they're because they've busy. got quite a few variety of cruises on that boat. Most people have heard about the grand finale show and the fireworks show, the grand one. But they've got daytime ones as well. And they've got the Coral Vision cruise, which takes you out to Coral Bay. Mm -hmm. You see? Competing with each other, aren't they? So the price on that is €74. Euros for a biggie mm -hmm. and 42 euros for a littley. And it goes out at 10 and comes back at three. It goes out on a Monday. It goes out on a Friday. And it includes complimentary drinks when you get on and a transfer, by the way, as well. And All transfer. of these cruises, well, the big boys, should we say, are gonna give you a free transfer. So if you're in Clorica, Tomb of the Kings, Ked of Paphos, yeah. somewhere around there, hotel, apartment, doesn't matter where you're staying, They'll tell you the meeting point, the bus will come, pick you up. When you're done on the cruise, have fabulous time, you get back on the bus and they take you back. It's so the bus idea. is taking them back mm. as well. So it's not yeah, bad, it's, is it? It's not too yeah. bad. Yeah, it helps a lot. Whenever you're that far, you always will know that the bus will come and take you and then will uh, deliver you back. This yeah, is safely. much very important yeah it is very important because uh, you might be living very far somewhere just for the peace of yours for for that very quiet time but once uh, in during uh, your vacation uh, holidays you would love to go somewhere as for the cruise and then you you should know that somebody will pick you up and deliver you back yeah i mean I, and i do believe we're not just saying that we're not in the pay of these boat companies, by the way, cruise ship companies. <laughs> I'm just going just to die <coughs> on camera. That coffee was a bit hot, but there we go, nice coffee. But um, there's no doubt about it. Most people who come to Paphos on a holiday are going to go on some kind of boat. Now, I think this is a general cruising and boating little video. As time goes on, we will do a boat 
cruise ship event on the Wave Dancer on Paphos Sea Cruises, and we will pick on, because they've got more boats, we'll do one on the Ocean Vision, one on the Ocean Blue, the Sea Star, the Flyer, and of course the Jolly Roger as well. A lot of these boats we've been on, so you can pop the name of the cruise ship into the YouTube search bar with those magic words, Marika and me, and more often than not, up we will come. This is the Super Jumbo glass bottom boat. That one is nice as well. I that think it is, is nice. because <sighs> cost of living, let's go to cost of living again. 75-ish euros times two, 150 euros. Mm -hmm. If you've got a couple of littlies, you're gonna be into a couple of hundred euros to go on the big boys. But if you are on a budget, or perhaps you don't wanna go on a boat for four hours, often people yeah. don't, but the kids wanna go on a boat. Yeah. This is yeah. the point, isn't it? Yeah. What about the super jumbo boat? See? That one in the harbour. Glass bottom boats, and they do two trips, by the way. So they've got a two and a half hour trip, and they've got a 90 minute trip as well. The two and a half hour is 25 euros per adult, and 10 euros for a literally between the age of two and 12. But if you're zero to two, totally free of charge. So that's not like bad. Like for me. Like for you. So you can go on for free. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would only eat Mama's titties. That's it. <laughs> I will not. There we are. I might I join not, you in that one. I, I will so not eat. I think any this food. is a very cost effective cruise. Yeah, yeah. So whether you go for 90 minutes or two and a half hours, the 90 minute cruise, by the way, is only 15 euros for yeah, an adult good. and only 5 euros for a little. And again, if you're going to be on Mama's such and suches, yeah, yeah. you're going to be free of charge. Balconies. Balconies, yeah. So a great little boat trip. And you can contact them on paphosglassbottomboat.com or go into the harbour and find Mr. Rickos and tell him those yeah. magic words. Very helpful he is as well. Me? Very He's helpful. Nice chap, yeah, he I've is. observed him a few days ago. Uh, really was watching. He couldn't see me and he couldn't see you as well. And uh, he was so helpful. Everybody could come and ask, and uh, it was a lady so annoying, really asking so many questions, and he just was standing there. I thought he will very soon, within a minute or two maximum, he will collapse, but he didn't. Very patient, man. He very didn't. Patient. Very patient. And, you know, we understand that, as he does, people are curious. What am I going to get from my Whenever money? you are in the touristic service, mm -hmm. people expect and the expectation of some of them are very high. So now whether you value your service or whatever you sell in that high or not, you should be the uh, representative efficient and should be always helpful. Uh, therefore, people will write down about you only the best comments because there's more better people than... Bad people. Somebody with a little R. Well, this is true. But uh, the super glass bottom jumbo boat, one and a half hours, 90 minutes, or two and a half. They've got a massive fun slide as well yeah. for the kids to go down. Huge sunbathing deck. Yeah. And what do you get? Well, you cruise out into the blueness of the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea, yeah. and you head out towards Yeriskipu Beach, the Rikos Beach. That's where it parks up. And that's where they put the slide out. You can go swimming. They've got showers. They've got snorkels you can use. And you get to swim for about 45 minutes. But before you get there, they take you over the old shipwreck, yeah. which is a boat that was bringing electrical conductors or something to Cyprus in about 1956. Unfortunately, hit some rocks and sunk. But because this has got a glass bottom, they go over it. And Rikos, the man who owns the boat, the gentleman, tells you all about it and then asks you a couple it's of questions. It's very interesting. It's you quite interesting if you've not been on it there. before. Yeah, it yeah is. we it went is. there and then uh, he, he does like a quiz. Quiz. Mm -hmm. Quiz. A quiz. Yeah. Quiz. 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 At the end uh, because he tells you story after story all concerning to this boat and some uh, legend uh, stories which really happened many, many years ago. And then he asks for the uh, questions it's sort of quiz and the people are so excited to ask answer these questions what Mr. Rikos gives to the people and they always uh, value it very high and they're really loving it. Well, it's like yeah, good really. pupils with a teacher isn't yes, it? Yes, yes, yes. It's quite fun, it's yes. quite fun. Again if you want to see us go on that boat Google 
Marie Crew and me, glass bottom boat. And guess what? That video will come up We've and you'll see there, us prancing around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember? In my opinion, it's uh, one of the best videos. And what a shame that people. Maybe we've done so many. Well, it's an old, old, we've old, old video. We've done so. It? it doesn't matter. Some old can be the best. Can be like our para sailing video. For example, like you, you're old, I'm but old. you are the best. I could be the best. <laughs> yes, indeed. So, two different operations on this super jumbo glass bottom boat. One is ninety minutes, mm -hmm. that little bit cheaper, and one is that little bit more expensive. But you also get a barbecue lunch included. Yeah. in the longer cruise so something to bear in mind so i think if you've got little ease and you want to go on a boat maybe go on that one because 90 yeah. minutes two and a half hours not that long with little ease and also say. i would like to say uh, concerning to the ocean vision many people would like to go on the last holiday uh, day there or uh, wedding anniversary birthday party proposal day uh, like uh, mm, Whitney, like Whitney yeah. and Jace, yeah, and Jace, and it it was, you know, I will not. We all knew about that. We all knew, and all they were coming, and uh, well, Whitney didn't know. Uh, well, no, Whitney didn't no. know. Whitney didn't know. Whitney everyone didn't else knew. Know. And uh, everyone else yeah. knew. I think even the table next to us. Everyone else knew. Everyone. Yes, the whole patient. boat knew, <laughs> except <No>. for Whitney. <laughs> whole boat. But didn't. she found out in the end. <laughs> Again, if you want to watch that video, it's in three episodes. And it's nice. Search for it. Marika and me, Ocean Vision, the proposal. Up it'll come. What a night to remember. From far away, they were given some marks and uh, some marks, you know, from far away and saying that uh, connecting to Paul or, or uh, Jace. Jace, yeah. It was so important for him. Uh, because he was worried as well, bless him. He oh, you're talking about Matthew now, Matthew. Right? the presenter. It's quite funny the way he did it. Mm -hmm. He walked, it, I, even I thought that perhaps Matthew had forgotten, but he is a professional oh, through yeah, and through. And when the show finished, he turned to me and he winked and off he went talking on his mic saying, mm -hmm. I want to get some feedback on the cruise. And he went straight to Jason, asked him where he was from and said, oh, can I get some feedback? Come to the centre of the stage. And he said, I think you've got something to say. Yeah. And all of a sudden, Whitney, she understood that something was afoot. Actually, we were sitting. I, w I started to shake all over now, as, as if Chase was proposing me. <laughs> I was just like that. And trying to talk with uh, Whitney. Uh, we were talking about weather, and I don't even remember something very Un, un, uh, imp not very important because I already started to shake and then uh, Whitney suddenly heard Jay's voice mm. on microphone mm -hmm. and she just stopped talking with me and all her ears and all her uh, everything uh, brain was there on the stage to which uh, very quickly he then said name of hers he said Whitney, can you please come? Come. Can you come closer? You and then he asked her on closer. one knee to marry her. Classic. And she said, "Oh no!" She said, "I said yes. I am not gonna go instead of on of you uh, to be proposed. You know, yes, of course." And whilst we were, I took her hand. She was shaking. It's a very emotional moment. Uh, she was sort of, of course, shy, and it, it, you could tell. But eventually, whilst we were going Magical through, night. whilst we were going through these ta uh, tables, and people were giving us applause, I was telling them, "I am not Whitney. <laughs> <laughs> it's you. It's not me. I was just brave to take you." So, like I say, why not go and watch those videos? That's and by it. the way, if you do like what you see, hit the like. Hit that subscribe, doesn't cost you a single penny. Please keep on coming back for that little bit more of our madness. Don't forget to drop it in the comments what you'd like us to do next. Tell us where you want us to go. And of course, please don't forget to go and keep the channel afloat by hunting us down on the Buy Me A Coffee platform. And that's where you could gift us that virtual coffee or two. Let's have a look at this one. This is a new one to the Paphos Harbour, really. And it is a three hour sea deep cruise. And it's like a semi, half a submarine. So it's got a pure glass bottom and then a boat on the top of it. 
and quite interesting I think it is by the way because it goes out at 10.30 in the morning every single day and it says here you can see all sorts of fish and turtles and all those kind of things and there is a turtle cruise as well in the harbour but unfortunately they were closed so we're going to get a brochure on them as well yeah. and do a special video on those because lots of people come to Paphos and they want to see turtles. We have seen many turtles. They come into the harbour, uh, by the way. There was even the, what it was, the octopus, and which octopus. bite and it. And that with bit Tom. Tom. Cruises, yeah, because huh? he was really uncareful to Well, take. it's a funny story, isn't it? Because there was a, an octopus perched on the side of one of their boats on the hull. And he went to gently move it into the water. Obviously, the octopus didn't understand that. He probably thought, you're going to eat me. So the octopus bit him. And he had to go to hospital and he was there for a couple yeah. of days. But uh, luckily he survived and so did the octopus. So, going back to this one, they've got a turtle watching cruise as well. Two hours of turtle watching on a sunset cruise. And that goes out every day at 5.30. And they say hop on board and enjoy. And that is 38 euros for an adult. And if you are 2 to 11, it is 15 euros. So again, if you're less than two. It's obviously free of charge. So that's yep. not bad, is it? So that's two hours of turtle watching for oh, less than 40 euros an adult. Yeah. That's pretty good. Children mostly would enjoy it I more. think the little will I enjoy it, yeah. little yeah. ones will enjoy it more rather, especially if you've seen it, you're now not ready to go for it again. But I think if you haven't seen it and you're a little mm. one, you, you would be enjoying it. You would be just uh, loving it. Let's see. I think so, yeah. So that's that one. Perhaps get on the internet and have a quick look at it. I think that could be a great addition mm -hmm. to the Paphos Harbour. Yeah. That's what I think. There's also a couple of fishing charters in the harbour as well, by the way. But again, we'll get their brochures when they're open. And I think we will actually do a sit-down video on each cruise. Because when you start talking about it, you understand that you could probably go on for about 20, 30 how minutes much, per boat, How isn't much it, it contains, yeah. the information is endless, facilities is endless. And then if we switch on to our conversation against the task, then we, we just don't want to keep you that long in front of your screens. Of course, we are loving the conversation with you all. And always we're thinking that this is only the, the only moments when we can uh, come to you closer, when we can open not only our door of our house, but our hearts and souls as well. And we're expecting, expecting, and I mean it, some more likes. This is how YouTube, and they did well. You know, bless. Listen to watching Grisina the Booth. Bless them all. Uh, on that very video, I will never forget that very video, what we've done. It was a couple days ago, and I did really um, <sighs> announced my wish. That was it. Nothing more, nothing less. All I said, please, people, the thumbs up is situating right down. If you just uh, will see that thumbs up and it's not uh, black or any other color, just I think, by the it. way, a lot of people now watch YouTube on TV. And I think this is a problem. When you watch on a mobile phone or on a laptop, right. it's okay. much easier. So I have on a TV, it. it's more complicated. Is it? But on that note, drop in the comments. Does the like button show? Does the subscribe button show? It must. Well, there must be a way to make it show. So please, please hit the like and please, please subscribe to the channel. It doesn't cost you a single penny and we'll keep on making our videos, especially for you. So, in our little bunch of leaflets, this final one, it is Venus Sea Cruises. There's its name. Our air conditioning in it is blowing us gently, shall we say, because it's a little bit warm. In well, course. sometimes it's blowing to take me away, but it's together with air conditioning. Sometimes we put the fan on it, but it's okay. So and all I would like to say, let me finish, on, please, then. darling. I would like to say that I noticed how did you just heard me and uh, you uh, made my wish to come true. And you really, uh, that very video had the maximum uh, like thumbs up I have ever seen since we started the video. But it's unfair to, to be trying, trying, trying and not to get in 
any likes, but believe me, it's so simple. Do it and we will do anything for you, just for you to enjoy and sit and relax with a cup of tea or coffee or every, anything uh, what you like to drink and enjoy the views. So we will be bringing more and more useful information for you to enjoy the life in Cyprus. So this is their little boat, Venus Sea Cruises, and of course it's like a yacht with sails, quite old nice. fashioned, doesn't it? And uh, they don't just do the lazy day cruises, they say half day cruises, two and a half hour swimming and sunset cruise, comes with a light lunch, but they also do private charters. Mm -hmm. This is what I'm coming to. So if you want to go on a private charter, 250 euros an hour. So let's say you wanted it for a wedding, like they're suggesting, or an anniversary, and you were going to bring 50 or 60 guests, obviously you're going to pay the bill. But let's say you went out for four hours, that's quite a long time on a boat. No, normally that's a Santa, thousand euros. Normally Santa Claus is coming to pay the bill. Well, maybe. But the point is, you can private charter this boat. Most of the other guys have got private charter boats as well. Paphos Sea Cruises certainly have. So we are going to take time to break down all of these cruises and do a video on each and every single one. On such a huge occasion, uh, it's worse to pay 250 euros per hour because now you now having the, the time of the life, uh, some pictures that uh, even the members of the board can make for you and you'll be taking these memories for whole life through and you'll never forget and never regret that you've done it. Well, that's true. Yeah, I mean, it's a wedding. It's, yeah. it's, in many cases, it's not the first time, but yeah. it's always meant to be the first and the last time. So meant. to hire and make a special, special occasion at a thousand euros, that doesn't sound too bad for me. Anyway, the half day cruise, if you're curious to know how much it is, 42 euros per person, 20 if you are a Italy. It goes out at 11 o'clock, comes back in at three o'clock, goes out on a Monday, a Wednesday and a Friday. On that note, we're going to say thanks for watching. And if you like what you see, as Graciela Bufus keeps on telling you, please hit the like. doesn't cost you a single penny. Hit the subscribe. doesn't cost you a single penny. But if you would like to say thank you and you would like to gift us a virtual coffee or two, you can always go through to our About page where the Buy Me Coffee link is. And you can also join us as a Superstar member. I'd like to say thank you to one or two of the people who are. If your name is Dayman, thank you very, very much indeed. If your name is Lady Carrie and of course Lord Tony, thank you very, very much indeed. It's very good and in the names. you like to smoke a cigar and you just happen to have a partner in your crimes who is the greatest, greatest accountant in the world, Baron Victoria. Von Cigar, Lady Victoria, <laughs> we thank you By the very way, much I, I'm indeed. missing them, so, so well, lovely. Coming very, very soon. Yes, I know and you, you always keep saying, talking about this. We, we all, once we met you, believe me, we can never forget. We may never forget about you, uh, especially we have sat uh, down, we told the stories to each other, and day after day we're becoming so close that when that time comes to say goodbye, I just want to disappear from this earth. Earths. No one ever wants to say goodbye to friends. Do they? No, I don't like this goodbyes, really. Uh, I remember our day. Anne was leaving many times. Uh, a but few you have times to leave to come back. Yeah, if you don't say goodbye, you never say hello. So true. we all understand that these lovely people living in, in UK, for me it's a different planet. <laughs> and uh, we understand that to this planet they will be all arriving uh, slowly uh, with a queue uh, starting from A, B, C, D and going on and on by the alphabet um, a rule. Uh, never forget that we always talking about you and once we become friends we will always thinking about you. If you ever need any help we are here for you to friends. Mostly this is the best driver of all the best drivers and he will be always running to you in order to help. If you, I, I wish it never uh, happened, but sometimes in this situation of life, life brings us un unpleasant um, accidents. Uh, so please remember. All that notes, if your name is Sir Bernie and of course Lady Jan, they're coming back to Paphos very, very soon indeed. I will be We're glad looking to forward see. to seeing you. And of course the Nantwich crew.
Very nice as well. Lord, John, Lord, Lord Simon, his very own warm beauty, Lady and Jessica. The, and the strongest girl in the world. Princess Megan. <laughs> and of course, my little mate, Gangster yes. Max. Yes, yes, yes. I'll be having some presents for you, little boy and little... She's not a little. He's not that little either, by no, the way. No, but they grow in like, uh, uh, like a flowers mm -hmm. every day, a little bit more and more. And, you, and we say that, that somebody's children growing up much faster than ours. Yeah, Do you know that's what how I it mean? appears, doesn't it? Do and a know? big shout out to another little mate of mine who's not that little. He's actually bigger than me now. He's our Viscount Leo. Big shout out to his dad, Sir Richard, and of course his oh, blonde beauty, Julie Nash. Julie, you remember how uh, Leo, <laughs> Leo was playing with this, what does it call? He was playing... A snorkel? S to go swimming? No, he... This is a, it's a computer game. Computer okay. game. He was putting this... Ah, the virtual reality <laughs> machine, yeah. Yes. Yeah. He was so funny, I will never forget. But of course, he could have seen something else that we couldn't see. And many times he was kicking well, the, the ice. <laughs> I was doing yeah. that. And he said, do you want to try? I said, of course I want to try. Mm -hmm. My God, how beautiful uh, pictures I could observe. This is another story, how I play with uh, uh, children and become a monkey of all the monkeys, dancing like a silly, stupid woman, as if it was my last day in the world. Anyway. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Thank you very much. Of course, much. we look forward to seeing you again very, very soon. Loving and kissing Indeed. you. We're going to have an unbelievably busy September. All of our friends are coming back on Big Birds. Looking forward. Looking One or two might be paddling like crazy. I think those two twins, those two <laughs> double troubles, might be paddling here. Yeah, but, they uh, will. They will. They're planning and on taking you as... to the Pathos Mile, by the way. We love them as well, from so, the bottom. Start boys, saving, we're boys. loving you. We're loving you. You. You're incredible. You're very nice. Thank you very much. That you're existing for us. So we always will be loving you. And our Carrie and Tony. Mm -hmm. And I'm looking forward for this singing beautifully like a bird in a paradise. I compare this. Carrie. Yep. Carrie singing is a sensation. bird. Singing Is a bird in paradise. She is it, indeed. Actually, I will now, when we switch off camera now, I will bring my microphone, my karaoke, and my lights. Oh dear, uh, that's it. And Big I shout start. out to Andy and Ness, by the way. They're coming as well. Oh, Thanks for wow. watching. We'll see you again very, very soon. And what about our Dame indeed. Anne? She's coming as well. I mentioned Dame Anne, and of course she's coming. We yes. never forget the girl in charge. We of are so her happy. Show. People, you're making us happy. We're loving and kissing you from the bottom. Why am I so hot? Because it's from hot. From which bottom we are kissing them, darling?